You were alive this whole time and you didn't tell me? Listen, Ivy, I can explain. You know what, Jacob? I don't want to hear it. We so fun. Ha, <laughs> uh, yay. Where is he? There he is. Kyle. Oh, Jacob, it's you. Hey, bro, I haven't seen you in so long. I thought you were dead. Dude, you sound drunk. Yeah, no, of course I'm not drunk. Come on. Get in the car. Why? Like, uh, what are we doing? Just stay there. I'll be right back. Ivy! Ivy, where'd you go? There she is. Ivy, please come with me. No, I don't want to see you. Why would you lie to me? Why would the doctors lie? You don't understand how sad I was when you left. It's not my fault, okay? I'm sorry. Let me take you home, come on. Fine, but you're taking me home, nowhere else. It just makes me really sad though to look at you. Okay, as long as you'll come with me, just come. Can I have the keys, please? Yeah, here. This is your house. Um, bye. Kyle, what happened at the party? Oh, nothing. Kyle, what happened at the club? Nothing too big. I just kissed Ivy. <laughs> you, what? I kissed Ivy. <laughs> yeah, she's a good kisser. <laughs> Were you the one who kissed her? Yeah, after that, she kinda went to the bathroom and she didn't come out, but I had a great time dancing with myself. Wow, just, just well. I can't believe him. He probably just did that because he hated me, probably. He's probably just planning something to kill me. But then he left me in tears waiting for him. Waiting for him to come back home when I didn't think he was. That's Kate's favorite piece of clothing. Hello? Hello, Ivy. It's me, Phoebe Jackson. Phoebe Jackson? What? Why are you calling me? We haven't talked in since seventh grade. I need your help for a mission. A gang mission? Like that kind of stuff? Doing illegal stuff? Is that what you need help with? Yeah. I know we haven't done stuff like this since seventh grade, but I need your help, please. One girl cannot kill two people on her own, so can you please help? Who exactly are you killing? Remember Jamie and Bella? Yeah, I remember Jamie and Bella. Wait, why Jamie and Bella? Do you not remember them always telling on us? Them always trying to ruin our lives? Do you not remember that from seventh grade? And even now in high school? Yeah, I remember that, but like, that was a while ago. And even if they still did it today, it's nothing new. I know, but this time she gone way too far. Jamie tried killing my sister, and even me. We need to give her payback, them payback. Okay, I'm it. Great. 
Jacob? Kyle, I'm not in the mood right now. What happened? Are you okay? I don't want to talk to you, Kyle. Did I do something wrong? What did I do? Do you remember what happened at the club? What? No. I barely even remember going to a club. All I remember is coming there and then leaving. With you, I guess. I don't remember anything. Except for leaving and coming. Just please, I don't want to talk to you. Fine. Jacob, listen to me. You are messed up and horrible. She will never love you. She probably never did. I mean, you did almost kill her and kill her sister. Why would somebody love somebody like that who hurt their family members? Even if you do love her, you shouldn't because she doesn't love you. Jacob, it's gonna be okay. She does like you. I know she does. She got mad at you because she thought you were dead. That's it. She didn't get mad at you because you were messed up and you killed her, almost killed her and killed her sister. Remember, she's like that too. She understands. She's killed people and been in jail before. Will you both shut up? Aw, uh, why? Can you not face the truth? You know, you should probably just kill her and even kill your brother, maybe. You'll have a much better life. You'll wipe all of your pain away. And it'll be much better. You could stop caring for these people. Do you hear me, Jacob? No, don't listen to him. The Riley's family was brought to you for a reason. I could love to you. I can tell. Stop. Please. Aw, Jacob's such, such a man, baby. What the... Jacob, are you okay? Kyle, I'm fine. I, I don't want to hear her name, so stop. I know that the Riley's family was horrible to us. Why would you start to hurt her when she barely did anything? Because she was involved in it. I thought that because their parents were horrible to us, they would probably be horrible to us. I mean, they messed up our lives anyway. Yeah, but that's their parents. Ivy, Riley, and... Oh, I, I didn't mean to say that. Uh, well, her and Kate Riley are not like that. They were in my school and they're amazing. They're really nice, caring, everything like that. They're also super smart. I don't want to hear anymore. You just make me feel worse. I'm sorry, I didn't know that would make you feel worse. You're making me regret killing her. Making me think I shouldn't have did it. I want to go back and change all life decisions now. I'm gonna try to switch the subject. I'm sorry for making you feel it that way. I didn't mean to, but... Why did you suddenly leave and then come back? The doctors were actually scientists. Hidden. In their weird way. When the doctors, they're actually doctors, they're scientists, but when they found out that I was alive, I guess they tranquilized me or something. Did something to make me fall asleep and bring me to their lab. Wait a second, the lab in Newcastle? I don't know what lab it is. Was there a blonde short hair with like orangish on her? Yeah, how did you know that? They're all over the news. They're talking about like, people are saying that they are doing tests of people. And I guess they were lying, I was right. So they were on the news to get interviewed or something? Yeah. Oh my God. Come on, Jacob, we're going to that place. You're driving.
you will have the easy work jobs. I will have the hard jobs. Well, unless you want to take one of my hard jobs. It doesn't really matter to me. But what are your hard jobs? They are killing and distracting, stuff like that. Wait, so what parts do I need to do? Weapon gathering and spying. Can I do the killing part? Maybe I can come out when you're done distracting? Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. But remember, I've been doing this for a while. You haven't done this in seventh grade. I know, but I wanna know how it feels to kill again. So we're doing this tomorrow night, Monday night, okay? Sounds good. Guys, I made a horrible mistake. I deleted the last scene, so, um, so, like, she, the thing that she said was, she said when you go all the way up and come to my house, and then she said to you, so, yeah, that's it. <laughs> anyway, let's get on to the next scene. Hello there, my name is, uh, what the heck, my name is Ivy Riley, yeah, blah, 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 okay. Um, what is a young girl like you doing at the shop? <sighs> it's none of your business. Jeez, teens these days. <sighs> I'd like to buy these two guns, please. Um, that will be $150. Here you go, take the money. And I will like a bag with that, please. Are you too young to be buying this stuff? Nope. I'm 20. <laughs> um, okay then. I'll go get you a bag. Um, here's your bag. Thank you. Um, that was a little bit strange. <laughs> yeah, it was very strange. I'm so tired. Hey, Phoebe, I hope you don't mind me just barging you like this. Oh, Ivy, hi. So you got all the weapons? <laughs> yeah, and guess what? I told the lady I was 20, so she would let me get it. <laughs> and she believed you? Wow. I know, right? Well, do you want to see them? Sure. 